okay? Shh. I'm sneaking around. Check out the big army luck with y'all. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. So, it's a beautiful day. As you can see, I'm running and walking fast. You know what I'm saying? I'm sneaking out. Getting away from people real quick. I don't even know if y'all can see me. Real quick, you know what I'm saying? I just came on here real fast, real quick to make another video. And this is definitely another. Got to be more careful. Okay, so the other day, this past weekend, I was uh, at Six Flags, you know what I'm saying? It was Military Appreciation Day. And so I was at Six Flags having a good old time, turning up, doing this, then the third. So when it was time to leave, I left, you know some battles and things like that in the car with my friend we was driving using gps gps you know it's supposed to tell you when to turn when to get over get off at an exit etc so we doing that paying attention to the gps i'm actually in the passenger seat because i'm over there taking shots you feel me what i'm saying i'm still turning it up enjoying the day of being appreciated by the people so was taking it all in doing as i do you know what i'm saying so then Listening to the GPS, it said make a left turn. So my friend he gets in the lane, she's ready to turn, and so you know when it's time to turn, the thing starts counting down. It goes from from miles to feet to etc. You know, and when it gets down to zero, it's your turn to turn. You know what I'm saying? It get the zero. She said, okay, it must be time to turn. She turns and O M G turn into oncoming traffic. to be more careful my goodness I thought I was finna die I sobered up so fast I just because all I saw was freaking headlights and I was like oh my gosh we about to die got to be more careful and then next thing you know it just so happened that the lane that she turned in no cars went in and it was just like but because she was turn she turned in kind of slow there's a car coming from this way on my side and i was like oh my gosh go and he just missed her and she turned right here and then before all these cars even got any closer she was able to make a u and get back in the lane got to be more careful but when i tell you all I did was just kind of see everything. It was crazy. Like, I was scared shitless. I ain't even gonna lie to you. She, we pretty much got ourselves together, just went on and freaking kept going the rest of the way. But we were so mad at the fucking GPS. It was just like, yo, you see what I'm saying? That's what I told her. I was just like, this is why I don't, I don't, I don't have an iPhone. You know what I'm saying? Team Droid all day. Okay? So, but you know, we got, we got to where we was going back to the hotel and everything like that safely. It was just, it was just that, that moment. It was just like, oh my God. So it was just like, God damn. Got to be more careful. So I guess what I'm trying to say is the moral of this story, yo, nigga, I don't, <laughs> I don't even know what the moral of this story is. I guess it's, you know what I'm saying? Yo, you might want to take driver's ed all over again. You might need your license revoked, like nigga, fuck it. Like just stay in the house and lock yourself upstairs, go in the attic, lay in the feet of position and eat a P and J with a tall glass of milk. But that's what it is, you know what I'm saying? So this your girl sticks. Y'all make sure y'all let me know if y'all got a story even similar to that, something along those lines. Go ahead, write it down there in the comments. Let me know what's up. And I'm about to get out of here before they come looking off for me. So you know what I'm saying? It's your girl sticks and I'm out. Gots to be more careful.